Let's make some delicious carne asada tacos on the Slow and Sear Kettle Grill. To get started, we have this beautiful flank steak that needs to be marinated in that carne asada marinade mix, and I put all the ingredients on the screen for you to screenshot. Once everything's mixed together, pour it over your flank steak and place it into the fridge overnight to allow those flavors to absorb into the meat. With our meat marinated overnight, it's time to get those coals roaring hot because we want to sear off this flank steak on both sides until we get a nice crust and an internal temperature of around 130 degrees after it's rested. For this cook, we ended up flipping the steak about four times and just take a look at how deep and dark this sear is. The only thing left to do is let the steak rest, slice it up, and then start building those carne asada tacos. Just take a look at how delicious these look.